Hi. Welcome, huh? No. How is it going? I hope the food is ready. Because uh, our special guest will soon be here. <laughs> now the food is almost ready. Yes, it's Chabagum. What about my daughter? Oh, she's inside preparing. Uh, let me wash my hands and legs. Is that right? No. Uh. Father, you are welcome. Me Amadio has tried that you useless mouth. So you are here lazying around when there is no water in the house. Now listen, go straight there. Pick the pot and fill the whole pot with water. Yes, father. Now move. Nah, enough of this. Enough. Must you always cause her on every given opportunity, even on a special day like this? She's our daughter, remember? Oh, point of correction. Your daughter, not my daughter. She cannot be. A child whose late father was my enemy until his death can never be my daughter. My late husband, Doni Emma, is no more now. Why are you holding malice against the dead? Maltreating his child. My own daughter, who is supposed to be your adopted child. Why maltreating her for the deed of the past she knew nothing about? Why? Woman, the sense of the father lives with the offspring. She cannot be my daughter. Nonsense. Father. Oh. You look so beautiful <laughs> for a special day like this. It's your day. Mm -hmm. Listen, very soon you will be crowned the queen of Ungalama Kingdom. <laughs> <laughs> Father, I can't wait. I'm excited. Who would it be? Listen, my dear. Just come. Let me go and freshen up. Thank you, Father. Thank you. It could go distance. It could win a battle. It's alive in every one of us that wishes to ignite it. Uh. From the past, uh, we used to be one blood, one love.
My prince, once more I want to say, I felt greatly honored when I received the news of your visit some days ago. My prince, I want to assure you that your visit is a fruitful one. <laughs> Thank you. Oh no, we hear who said you are his best friend. Oh yes. Talked so much about your daughter's beauty and good behavior. <laughs> and that is why I have actually come to see if he's right. And should he be? <sighs> to introduce my intentions of making her my woman, my wife in waiting. And a woman I will be crowned with as a queen when I will succeed my father. As for your hand in marriage, and you didn't even care about me. Agi, Agama, your love. Is it fair? Agama, Agama, I am sorry. There is nothing we could have done. You just have to get past this. Say, Nkechi, Nke, Nke, my love. Nke, you know how far we've gone. Say, you have two options in this situation. It's either you say no to the prince or you had me Akama hang myself straight side. Okay. Serious. Um, uh, now that we have reached a consensus, can you now call your daughter so that the prince will see her and know whether he's still interested? <laughs> hey, okay. Hey! 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 Let's, let's take it. Hey! 
It is a poisonous bite. Thank the gods. The herbalist is taking care of her. She will soon be fine. We have to go back to the palace. We will adjourn the visit to a future date. Thank you, my prince, for your concern and understanding. No, thank you. Oh no. Let's join others. My prince. Greetings. Who are you? My name is Adobe, daughter of Umar the Bawan Tepa. Onoma. Onoma the Wine Tepa. Yes, my prince. Whose house I just visited? And no one ever mentioned you. And why are you like this? What's the problem? There's no problem at all, my prince. No, there is. Tell me, what is it? I have no story to tell, my prince. Uh, God? You come and help her with this. No, I'm, I cannot. No. Something about you that drew me to you the moment I set my eyes on you. Something very strong. It's only the gods that can tell this strong thing about you. My instincts never lies to me. It's okay. You just have to start going so that you see your sister. She was beaten by a snake. Beaten by a snake? Yes, it's okay. Um, the herbalist is on it already. He's taking care of her. It's okay. It's okay. She's fine. She's fine now. To finish this journey I started. Thank you, my prince, for keeping to your words. I finished with the other protocol the other time I came. May I request the presence of the bride to be? As my prince wishes. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I have changed my plan. I want to marry your daughter Adobe, not in kitchen. Aaron! Abomination! Kedebe kareme! Kedebe ngudu fareme! Osigini! Nkichi, my sister, I am so sorry. I honestly feel so bad that you lost the prince's proposal to me. But you know it wasn't intended. You know that from my heart, I do wish you well. I wish I could make him change his mind. But you know, no one can question the prince's decision. Biko, Biko, my sister. I'm very sorry. 
take her beacon. Your sister is right. This is a situation none of us can do anything about. Maybe that was the design of the gods. You have to move on. Please. Thank the gods we did not lose him entirely. Not when you will still marry your blood sister. Please. It's okay, I understand. Thank you very much for your understanding, Kitchen. The gods have their reason. <laughs> Mama! Hi. what is it? Mama, I saw Nyan Noma, your husband. He fell from the palm tree when he was stopping by one. He died on the spot! <laughs> Come, let me show you! Hey! have to take out of Adimi's hand. The gods always have a purpose for everything we pass through. Be it good or bad. I have to put a stop to everything about my marriage plans. Till this morning period is over. Thank you very much, my son. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you, my friend. You're welcome. <laughs> uh-huh. These two lovebirds will cease to amaze me. I mean, when are they ever going to stop displaying this their love drama at every given opportunity? That love is eternal. That love is forever. <laughs> you see that man over there? He would do anything, just anything to make sure that my sister Dobie is okay. Um, well, does that mean they are finally going to settle down as husband and wife? Like you don't know the marriage preparations has already started. Eh? Hmm. Aluchi. Yeah? Are you jealous? <laughs> Are you serious? Why would I be? I just had to ask. Very soon. She would get married and she would become the Lolo. And I, the Lolo's sister, too. Indeed, it is so. Uh, well? Congratulations in advance. Thank you. Say that again. Let's fetch this water. I don't want them to see us and get distracted. Okay. Oh no. Yes, Your Majesty. I want to see my son immediately. Consider it done, Your Majesty. God. Oh, no. Send for the prince immediately. Now. I'm sorry to interrupt my prince. The king seeks your presence at the palace at once. Is my father's head getting worse? I think you need to see him, my prince. You should go. I'm fine. Really, you should go. Uh, Alright. Um. Your Majesty. 
prince is here. Father. Father. Son. Let's sit down. How are you doing, Father? I'm doing great. Yes, my son. Please sit down. I thank our gods and our ancestors for keeping our life to this moment. Drink it to water. No. If which is her horses, then the beggar would like to ride. I like your, your courage. I like your courage and goodwill. These are the qualities of a great king that will lead you to peddle the affairs of, of this kingship when I am going to join my ancestors One more thing. I want you, you I, want, I want you to realize that you're my only son. The heir apparent to the throne of this kingdom. I align it with this a great I align it with face a great threat. If anything <laughs> happened to you, <laughs> therefore <coughs> you must protect our family name <laughs> by settling down, by settling down <coughs> with your future wife, Adobe, <laughs> so that you can give me and grandchildren <coughs> who will oppose the family name if I come to see the, to see my ancestors. You, your courtship is uh, is enough. Complete the marriage process as you're about to ascend. The throne of Ungalamba Kingdom to continue from where I stopped. I, I have I've heard you. I've heard you. As we speak, my marriage plan is ongoing. Mm. Uh, but Father, please, you should stop talking about me sitting on the throne why you are still alive you are still the king please oh, my, my son remember all that i said be a good king to your subjects farewell the son of odumozo Bring the king back. 
tears will not change the fact that the king is gone. Remember, you are the next king of Ngamala Kingdom. And weakness is not a trait of the king. Be strong. And may the gods give you wisdom to rule your people. Thank you for your words of consolation. They have indeed given me hope and courage again. There's still something that puts smiles on my face. And that is? Knowing that we will soon be joined together as husband and wife. It's one of the best things to ever happen to me too. Uh, now that the mourning process of our late king, Igor Dumudu has passed, we expect to commence the crowning process, which includes you getting married to your wife to be Adobe. Who will be crowned together with you as your law lord? My fathers. Oh no. Consider it done. Enough, my lord. Enough. Calm down, for the gods are not asleep. No word is enough to pacify a man who is as heartbroken as Sion. A man whose heart has been wrapped in the claws of anguish and sorrows. A man whom sadness become his daily fish. This is two years. Since two years we got married. Not a cry of a baby. I wonder what. I have done to the cause that they have decided to visit me with plans. It's not a plague, my love. The gods cannot be silent for too long. Very soon, just very soon, they will bless my womb with a seed. For how long? For how long will they hold it? Have they not humiliated and tortured the king with something they bless? Even the lowest inhabitant of my kingdom with. I feel like I'm crushed. No, no. No, my lord. I'm a disappointment to my late father. No. And my entire lineage. The man to place on my hands is <laughs> about to fall. Oh. Doom and sadness is what my future holds. Enough, my lord, enough. Enough curses on yourself. I see a bright light. And I know that soon. The gods will smile on us. Let us be patient. Do not curse the gods. It's 
It is really eating him up. He neither eats nor sleeps. I'm so worried. Mm. I fear I'm gradually losing him. To fear what? It's okay, sister. We can only hope. Be patient and pray for the gods to intervene. Your junior sister is right. Yes. Our only hope lies with the gods, the giver of children. You know? I know that they, they, they're seeing your tears. They will come to our rescue. He said. Very well, mother. I need to leave. I hate to leave him in this emotional state. I have to hurry back home. I understand you, my daughter. But you have to wait for the food on the fire to be done, please. So you can eat something before leaving. Mother. Ne. Very well, then. <laughs> now see it's because of this your nonsense attitude that made me lose lose the marriage to the prince status Mkechi. in fact i don't know what to say to you you're talking about status now because the prince came to you when we were doing it in the bush even secretly behind your backyard you were saying give it to me harder give it to me more give it to me more did you complain about status you're a stupid girl in fact, Nkechi, what is Nkechi? Nkechi, jump! Please just go. Stupid girl. So Look at your face. You want to give to the prince. Give them one. Waka! Shaking pain 
Yet again, you are worried. Why trouble yourself about a situation that you cannot change? Why have sleepless nights about a problem that you cannot solve? As painful as it seems, it's only a shackle of life. It's a shackle of life. Shackle of life. Get it. I am a mother. You are pregnant. You are. Mother be pregnant. Don't yeah. mother me. Don't. <laughs> Who is responsible? Why? <laughs> Get it. Don't dare me. Don't dare me. Who is responsible? Mama. I don't know, I don't know. What? Why I am I tell you? Aguma! Aguma did wrong! How could I make such a drastic mistake? Foolishly opening my ties for that pig. Now it has landed me to shame and humiliation amongst my fellow girls and the entire kingdom. The gods of our land. What do I do? How do I stand this shame? to you to desist from that useless relationship i warned you i told you he was worthless how could you bring yourself so low to make such an error ada i wish i listened to you i wish i listened to you this is the mistake that will haunt me for the rest of my life Well, I have a plan. What do you have up your sleeves this time? I want to meet Omacha the Habilist to help me with Unchu leave to flush this. Shh. Hey! Gods of our land. You want to terminate a life? Ngechi! You want to make yet another mistake? A grave one for that matter. You... You want to take the life of a child that I am looking for? I cannot let you do that. It is a mistake, Nkechi. It will not only haunt your body. It will haunt your life, your soul, your conscience. Okay, now, Ada. What do you suggest I do? deed has been done. You have to live with it and learn from your mistake. Hey. Hi. Why am 
Evil from you. I'm scared and worried, but I honestly hope that you do not disappoint me. I am all ears. Ask whatever. You're my blood sister, aren't you? The least I could do is disappoint you. Very well then. Yeah. Get you. Mm -hmm. Can you? I mean, will you? Would you speak? Ask me. Can you marry my husband? What? Do you realize what you're asking of me? To marry your husband? Adobe? Yes. We're sisters. One blood. We ought to share when the need arises. What does it matter? You have what I do not have. What I may or may never have as a woman. A life in your womb. Something my husband and I crave for. If you do not marry him, Kichi, he'll certainly marry to try for a seat, an heir to his throne. Think of the consequences, my sister, of bringing the total stranger to my house, of sharing my matrimonial bed with a stranger. Save me from this shame, pain and disgrace. Bear this child for my husband, a child from my own blood. Marry him and sleep with him and pretend this child is his. It will be a secret between us. Sisters, one blood. I will not tell him you're pregnant. Save me from this pain, Kichi. And save my husband from this emotional torture that has threatened to rip him apart. Help me, my sister. If you do this for me, Kichi, I will forever be indebted to you. Please. What say you? You haven't slept. You've refused to eat anything. You will lose your mind if you continue like this. Besides, I have a solution to this problem that I wish to discuss with you. What solution? 
my lord i my king my love i want you to marry my sister Nkechi. what might not be fertile but i am sure she is are you out of your mind do you realize what you're asking me to do? Yes. To marry your own blood sister? Yes. You are king. And you can marry as many women as you wish. I would rather you marry my sister than bring a stranger home. Let her dry these tears. Let us stop this fear. We have lived in for two years without a child. Please, marry her and let her wipe our tears away, my lord. I want you to smile. I want to smile. Please. I do not wish to share my, my heart and my soul with another woman except you. No, my love. You're not sharing your heart and your soul with her. You're sharing our home. Our matrimonial bed. For us to smile. Please, my lord. Please. I will do anything to make you happy. I will do your wish. <laughs> Are you people sure of the decision you, you have taken? I know why I am asking. I am an elder. I see beyond your understanding. Are you sure? Mother, we are sure and we have made up our minds. Yes, mother. This is the least I can do to save my sister from this pain and humiliation. Don't worry. Everything will be alright. Hmm. If you say so.
sister. <laughs> you do not know how happy you have made me. Thank you so much for bringing peace to our household. Come on. You don't have to thank me. We are one blood. It's the least I could do. And I promise you, we will live in peace. May the gods bless you, Kichi. Bless you too. But I need to ask one more favor from you. What? Please. Please make him happy in bed tonight. <laughs> was beautiful. And yours? I hope it was fun. Uh, it was not. Without you by my side. My lord. You have to get used to it now. She was okay. My love, I don't want to talk about it. Please. I actually came because I know how lonely it must have been for you without me. But I'm glad I'm back in 
to your arms now. It's been known for me since you came. But you have to break the news to him today. It's the time is right. Yes. Before your tummy becomes pronounced, to avoid suspicion. Okay, as you wish. Very well then. I have good news. What good news? I'm pregnant for you. Don't tell me it's a joke. No, it's not a joke, my king. I can't joke with such. Oh. <laughs> May the gods be praised. May the gods be praised. Your sister was right. Oh. You have indeed made me more happier than I have. Thank you. Thank you for bringing blessing to this home and my kingdom. I promise you, I will cherish you more than I have ever done. Thank you. Tell me, what was his reaction? I have never seen him that excited before. Oh. I knew it. I knew he'd be so happy. Finally, he's going to become the happy man he has always been. And all his sorrows will be over. Oh, Nkichi. <laughs> Thank you so much. Come on. Thank you for saving us. <laughs> Thank you. My sister. Please tell me. He smiled? He smiled. He even <laughs> touched my tongue. <gasps> he did. I love how you feel it. A bit feverish. I'm sorry. I will send for Macha the herbalist to come and check on you before your illness gets worse. Thank you, my lord. Please, don't be sad for me. Okay. Long live your majesty. You sent for me. The queen, my wife, has been feeling sick. I want you to see to her. Always at your service, your majesty. Where is she? At her chamber. The guards will take you to her. The ghost has favored her. How? I. But my wife is only sick. She has your seed in her womb. Mata. Um. Oh. I'm pregnant. What? Oh, Mata. Are you, are you, you must be joking. You. you are you joking? Did the ghosts joke, Your Majesty? Rejoice for their blessings. <laughs> ah, the ghosts praise. What good news! Indeed, Nkechi. Mm -hmm. Of what use is it then? Now the gods has blessed you with the same reason you brought me into this palace, the fruit of the womb. What use am I then? 
Kichi, don't sound like that. Hey, you are still my sister and my co-wife. Moreover, the king has officially married you. We will live together in peace like we used to. You're right. You're very correct. Come to fulfill the promise I made to Unguku, our God. The promise I made in my days of doom and childlessness. That if Unguku, our God, blesses my wife with a fruit of womb, I shall return with gratitude. Today, my kinsmen and I have come with these goals as a way of gratitude. Thank you, Njinji. Please help us thank and appreciate the gods for this good thing they have done for my household. Thank you. Mm. <coughs> I Very well. <clears throat> How are you feeling? Good. I'm okay. Would you? Yes, you want to majesty. get her some water? Okay, mm -hmm. your majesty. I'm okay. Please, your majesty. Let me go and get something for you, please. Come on, I said I'm fine. There goes Uju for you. It's very well, Uju. Okay, your majesty. Thank you. So, Adam, my sister, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. <laughs> so, how is her husband? Oh, he went out. Hmm. Went out, really? Yes. To where? His joy has been overwhelming since my conception. So he went to give thanks to the gods with a huge rap. <laughs> <laughs> That's so good. Yes. Wow. Your pregnancy seems to be the only thing that has given him much happiness. Of course. That is the only thing fit to make him happy. <laughs> I'm glad. Thank you, my sister. Come on. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you too. Now I need that drink. Okay, my just I'll be right back.
is the reason it goes up. My baby. The garment. My baby. <laughs> My baby. How long is it going to take? Do you want to break down the skirt? What? Go, go. go and tell the king that I need to see him in my chambers now. Go! <laughs> Oh, underneath. Long live my king. The queen, her majesty, requests your presence in her chambers. She said it is urgent. Um, tell her I will be with her when I come back. Yes, your majesty. No, my lord. You should go and see her. Besides, you still have an hour before the meeting. My love. Let's go. No. She said it was urgent. You should go. sent for me, I and went to your chambers, but you weren't there. What are you doing in my bedroom? I'm not feeling fine, Your Highness. I'm not. And then let's send for Macha the Havelist to come and take care of you. No, 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 no. We don't need a Macha the Havelist. I'm just not feeling so well. You've been avoiding me of late, and loneliness is sure one of the reasons I'm like this. Hey. Mm. I'm sorry. Hey. It's just that I... It's okay. It's okay, my king. I don't need this explanation. Just come. Last prince back love. A hurry to bring your meal. I never knew my sister had brought one for you already. But very well then. You shall have mine at night. What did you prepare? For so, Sonic, you see. What? Oh, be dear. You sure know how to charm my heart with your delicacies. <laughs> um, in that case, it's this one first. Get cheese food, 
with right no 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 you shall have mine at night no 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 please i want to eat this one now very well then yes <gasps> Way to feed him with yours. Eh? Is it not enough you've taken the king's attention away from me and now pushed it aside to your own? Hmm? Is it not enough? Adobe, how can you be the selfish, wicked, and callous? time to explain what happened. Explain? Explain what? Like I don't have eyes anymore. Like I don't have eyes anymore. Huh. Huh. Now I see that you brought me into this palace just to be the king's bed warmer and then bear kids for him. And now it looks like you've achieved your goal. You want to push me aside. Can you stop that madness? Stop it! What is wrong with you? You should have and hear what happened before this stupid violence. Like I said, there is nothing to explain. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for everything you've done for me. Thank you for maltreating me. Thank you for how you've treated me here. May the cause judge you. <laughs> Wait. What is wrong with her? I wish I knew. I've got good enough, yeah. Can I go on a down here to see you. It's unfortunate that you misunderstood all that happened. I came here to apologize to you and also to explain to you... Adobe! I told you. I don't need your explanations. I don't need any explanations from you. Can you calm down and even hear how it all happened? What? Just leave here! Leave me alone! I don't even live here! I didn't Again. How many times have I told you that you are my personal maid? Personal maid! Now listen, let me tell you. This should be the last time I will ever repeat myself. Do not run errands for this so-called Adobe again. Queen Adobe or what? Yes, my Have I made myself clear? Yes. Have I made myself clear? My queen. Follow me. Yes, you have something yes, to do. Last prince of love! Let's 
behavior of late is really shocking and alarming. I have equally tried to talk to her about this fire of hatred and malice burning in her heart towards you. But I can see no amount of water can quench it. Well, maybe that is one of the signs of pregnancy. I don't know, but my way. Be it as it may, I believe with time she will change for good. Just give her a little time more, please. My lord, I do not think this is about time. Perhaps something needs to be done. I understand, but please. Give her more time. Let's see if, if she can change. Please. said she's been doing recently. What has come over her? I do not know, mother. I don't know. I am in shock. Ah. Anyway, thank the gods oh. I've sent for her. Let her come so that I will know what her problem is. Kill the Fedifa. Sleepless night can never change anything. It can only jeopardize your health. Please give her some time more. I believe she will change. She will change. Suddenly come over you. Eh? 
Why have you chosen to become a nightmare to your own sister in your matrimonial home instead of living in peace with her? Thank you, mother. Thank you for saying in my own matrimonial home. I have not had a moment of peace since I got into that palace. This lady sitting right here is a pretender. She is selfish. You're surprised? Ikechi, how dare you say that to me? You lie against me to my own face? What is wrong with you? I have shown you all the love a sister ought to show a sister. I have shown you all the love that you deserve. All that I have. The king, our husband that you speak of, I brought you to him. Just like you stole him away from me. What is that thing you told him that made him turn his mind away from me? Tell me! Tell me what you told him! Oh, you don't know. Pretender. <sighs> Mother, I can't sit down here and discuss with this betrayer. Mm. You think I've forgotten? You think I have forgotten? The palace and the king are supposed to be mine if you haven't interrupted. You have to forget all that. They are all in the past. Huh? Mother, there is no future, no present without a past. What are you saying? You are cutting your pound of flesh? <laughs> hey. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I am directly taking what rightfully belongs to me. The king. Nothing is wrong with me. I am sorry, mother, but I have to leave. You can't walk out on me. I am your mother. <laughs> I'm not trying to walk out on you, mother. But I'm trying to walk out on this thing here. Pretender. A green snake in a green grass. Say you don't know. Nkechi! Nkechi dele! What are you doing there? Uh -uh. Eh? Are you blind? Can't you say I'm fetching some water? You're <laughs> fetching some water? Does this look like the pot of water in your queen's chamber? Eh? Or have you not heard that my queen, Queen Inkechi, has instructed that neither you nor any other maids of Queen Adobe should share anything with us? Hmm? <laughs> Indeed. Well, like I have said, it was my queen. Queen Adobe, who instructed me, Ujumwa, to fetch the water. And this water pot is meant for the whole royal household. Besides, my queen, Queen Adobe, is the first queen in this kingdom. Hmm? Not like your troublesome queen. Eh? queen. What did you just say? The queen was here this. Yes. Who cares? Do I look as if I care? If you like, tell the king it's none of my business. Nonsense! Yeah? Would you want? <laughs> if you touch me, <laughs> What is going on here? What is going on here? I saw her fetching water from my water pot. And when I confronted her, she started insulting me. In fact, she started insulting you. What? Yes, by calling you the junior queen. And that you have no right to give instructions in this palace. Yes. You pig! So you open that your stinking mouth to insult me. What is wrong? What you need? What is wrong? Enough. 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 Enough in kitchen. Ujumwa. What, what happened majesty? here? Your Majesty. 
I was only fetching water. One of them that came and said I should stop fetching the water. That the water pot is meant for their queen's chamber. I told her that. Enough, would you? Nkechi, I do not care to know what happened. I do not care to know the reason for this practice. But what bothers me is what you stand to gain by planting a seed of discord amongst everyone. What do you stand to gain, I ask you? Who are you to ask me such stupid questions? Have you not been the one going around to tell these maidens that I'm inferior to you? Have you not been the one telling them that I'm your younger sister? Enough is enough, Nkechi. Do not mistake my silence for stupidity or as a weakness. When I am quiet, it's because I want peace to reign. Have it at the back of your mind that I am still your elder sister. But what will happen? I was just polite a few moments ago, but now I can see that you are nothing but a witch. Do not speak. Oh! Oh! As painful as it seems, it's only shackle of life. It's a shackle of life. Shackle of life. Congratulations, my lord. The gods have blessed us with a son. May the gods be praised. Congratulations, your majesty. Omata, thank you. My queen. My lord. We must celebrate. We have to. <laughs> like I said, your majesty, she doesn't want to see you. Go back in there and tell Queen Inkechi that I insist on seeing her. Okay, Your Majesty. Leave us, Ujuma. sister and my blood <laughs> I stand before you today in all humility and love love from a sister to ask for your forgiveness if there's anything I have done to hurt you or upset you please my sister forgive me this fire of hatred burning in you for me is breaking my heart. Nkechi, you're a mother now. I want us to live in peace like we used to. Biko, please forgive me and let's live in peace as one blood. Adobe. Adobe. I was busy with my son, the prince, inside. And you insisted that I come out here. Huh? Now listen. Nothing, and I repeat, nothing on this earth will make me forgive you till I die. So if you're done, you can leave. I just... I said leave!
gorgeous. Go to the... Oh. Oh, I'm I'm so sorry with you. So I mean I Let me just please are you okay? I'm I'm perfectly fine with you. I'm sorry. I'm I'm very okay. With all due respect, Your Majesty, I don't think you look happy. Please permit me to say that I know the reason for your sadness, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, please don't let it bother you so much. I may not know the reason why she, she hates you so much. But one thing I know is that you are a good woman, Your Majesty. And you deserve to be happy. Please, Your Majesty. Just leave everything for the girls to judge. I believe one day she will come back to her senses. Please, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, it's of great honor to serve you, Your Majesty. Ujuma, thank you. And may the gods also bless you with a good man to call husband. Thank you, Your Majesty. She's got a Having this child does not guarantee my victory. She is still a threat. She might get infuriated one day and reveal the secrets of my child's paternity, especially now that I've made our enmity pronounced. <laughs> and should that happen, I will lose. I won't give her a chance. Something must be done. And it must be soon before it's too late. Nina. Yes, my queen. You're the only person I can trust here. I have somewhere I need to go to and it's very urgent. I need you to take care of my son. And do not, I repeat, do not let that witch come close to my son. And my queen. And as for the king, if he asks about my whereabouts, tell him I went to Nko Market to get something. As my friend pleases. You are the only one I can trust in Nina. Yes, my friend. Woman, 
Speak. Ovuru is listening. Tell Ovuru what you want again. I want her dead. I want her dead as well as the child in her womb. Ovuru has heard your request and we do as you wished. It on her doorway. Don't let anyone see you. Once she steps on it, she will die before she delivers. Thank you, Umbala. I do not feel very well. Perhaps I should retire to my chambers and rest. If you say so, I will send for Amacha, the herbalist, to come and check on you. Thank you, my lord. Uh, Your Highness! Uh, 
Ekwola chaka Anyi kwa di laman uwe Onye mekwana kome gidi benyano Makana mweli feli talana wa afo we juzi eno noe Your Majesty, the Queen is in level. Please, send for the midwife immediately. Okay, Your Majesty. Oh, no. Okay, Your Majesty. Immediately. Okay, Your Majesty. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> hey! United we stand, divided we fall. Someone please help me tell them. And nobody, an island. I was again in a bed. I was again in a funeral. I'm a one in a day. I was again in a I'm a one day. We could be praised, the gods of our land. What? That's the cry of a baby. Ah! Oh, this can't be. Why? 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 Ah! Mm. Uh, no matter who. Wrong or right, peace is still the answer. World is not a solution. Let's unite now. Oh, Matcha, I know the good news. She gave birth to a baby girl. But we lost the pain. Your oh, Majesty. What happened to Bala? She delivered of the baby. Woman, it is not my fault. The child is a destiny one. That's why she was given birth to. The gods saved her. You must kill her. You must kill her. No harm can come close to her. If you try that, you will incur the wrath of the gods. If I may ask, why do you want her dead? None of your business. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It is it Mama, is it's not okay. Please. Why would they take my sister? Why would it be my sister? Why would they take my sister away now? Who am I? Who, am, who will I laugh with? Who will I share my pains with? It's okay. Wipe your tears. Tears will not bring her back. <laughs> be strong, please, so that I don't lose you too. Amen? Mother, it is better I am dead than living. Don't say that again, please. <laughs> you still have me. I am here for you. <laughs> it's, okay. it's okay, my daughter. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Do you want to make me childless? Do you want me to lose you? Your 
Majesty. I have come so that we will discuss the land dispute with Umuabe Kingdom. Oh no. I am not in the mood for any official discussion. Your Majesty, this is three moons since the remains of your late wife Adobe, the Queen, was buried. You should not continue in this psychological torture anymore. You have to put her behind and live up to your responsibilities. Remember who you are, the king of Ungalama kingdom. Weakness is not a trailer of our king. You have to try and move on. Put her behind you and move on, your majesty. I wish I can. Oh no, I wish I can. You have to try. Your Majesty, you have to try. Put her behind you and move on. Try. And I have seen how much you love and care for her, the princess. Therefore, I'm employing you to take good care of her until she begins to work. Please, Omacha. Take good care of her like your own child. I will reward you handsomely if you do your job well. I am honored to serve you, Your Majesty. Thank you. You're welcome. You may not leave. Even in the world, I'm gonna be a good Oh, I'm not gonna be a Oh, I'm not gonna be a good one. Oh, I'm not gonna be a good one. Oh, Chief MD! You're here eating. When are the water cans are empty? You had better go to the stream and fill all the water cans. Do you understand me now? What nonsense! Will you get up and go to the river and go and fetch those water? If I starve you for three days, get up from there! Just imagine! Wait, wait. But this water is too heavy for you to carry. Moreover, there are mates in the palace who could help you with this. <laughs> Let me help you with this water pot to the palace. Thank you for your concern, sir. If not, my mother will beat me. Your mother will beat you. Oh, don't worry. Let me just help you. You forget Put it in my head. Uh -huh. <sighs>
Heavy port. Do you want to kill yourself? It was mother that sent me. Okay, check again. Is she not a human being? Does she not eat? You went to complain to your father. You went to complain to him, right? Will you shut up? Shut up! Why are you constantly being wicked and cruel to this little child? If someone should treat this your son here the way you're treating this child, will you like it? Listen. You see this fire of evil, your lightning. When it will begin to burn you, you have a story for the gods. I don't see anything wrong in sending a child on an errand. I don't. But if you do have a problem with it, that's your business. I need some peace, please. Will you shut up? Shut up! This fire will burn you. When it will come, see you don't call me. My princess. I was a 
Sing me my favorite song. Yes, my queen. Sorry, mother. It was a mistake. You're sorry. So your intention is to break is to break my this for me. Is to break my this for me. Come back here. Will you come back here now? Take it. Come back here. Take it. Are you mad? Why has she gone? Why are you beat her like she's your bed? Imagine this stupid girl. This stupid girl intentionally broke my dishes. And so what? Is that why you want to kill my daughter, the princess, for me? And let this be the first and the last time you lay your filthy hands on my daughter. This is my last warning. If you try that again, you have me to contend with. You're threatening me. You're threatening me because of this thing. Hey! Shh! Don't call her names. This is my last warning for you. We shall see. We shall see. She's empty. She's empty. She's empty.
It's okay. It's okay. Stop. Stop crying. Stop, my dear. Stop. It's okay. Why are you crying? It's okay. Why does mother need me so much? No, 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 no. Don't say that. She does not hate you. She's only human. Sometimes we human beings could be annoying, we could be aggressive to each other. Okay? She doesn't hurt you. Okay, listen, I've warned her never to harm you, treat you bad, or talk to you anyhow again in this palace. Okay? And she has assured me that she will not do it again. She has agreed. Come on, my dear. You know I love you so much. Huh? Please. Let's go to bed. Tonight, you will share my bed with me. I invited you here so you can talk to her like a mother to a daughter. Warn her. The next time she will maltreat my princess, my daughter again, I will not only throw her out of this palace, I will make sure she faces the deserving punishment. I apologize for her wicked act towards my grandchild. And I promise to talk to her as your majesty requested. Please, I'm sorry. Better do. And make sure you have enough refreshment and your usual gifts before you leave. <laughs> Thank you for your kindness, your majesty. Thank you. How could you? Nkechinere, how could you? How could you maltreat your niece like that? What has the innocent child done to you? You may be having problems with her late mother. Your sister. But why should you transfer the aggression to an innocent soul? Nkechinere. Look. You have to desist. You had the king's threat, should I repeat. I have said my own. Oh no. Don't say I didn't warn you. Anyway, I am leaving. If you like, kill her when I am gone. Will you say anything? The king is obviously serious about his threat. She is gradually eating into his heart that he barely gives my son and I due attention. <laughs> Something has to be done. Something has to be done. I want his heart turned away from her. I want him to care less if she lives or dies. I want him to care just for me and my son alone. I want my voice to be his command and my wish his desires. Ovuru. Ovuru. Woman, consider it done. Oh, 
Ovuru. Ovuru. Oh, look when you go see you. Oh, look when you buy me a new manicure. Jire ni atania. Don't ever match match with me. Menu ya jiji manji yo. I tie this. I tie the king's heart against his daughter. She will stop existing in his heart. <clears throat> like water and fire, they have nothing in common emotionally. Heheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheh
Are you okay? No, I'm feeling sick. Oh, I'm so sorry. Ah, so sorry, your body is hot. Ah, see, she seemed dead. I would have helped you. But you know that the queen wants us that whenever she sends you an error, we shouldn't assist you. Mm. But... Uh, I don't want to put you in trouble. No, she said we don't want to No, 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 I don't want to mm. put you in trouble. Don't worry, I can handle it. Look at your body, you're sick. Just get a rest, okay? Thank you, you have always been kind to me. Oh, don't worry, it's nothing. Against my instructions. Hey, hey. Why is that stupid girl? Why? Get away from here. And you feel you can disrespect me. You feel you can disrespect me. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. If 
It's okay. Please stop crying, okay? Huh? Why does she hate me so much? Why? Not only you, but also your late mother. When? No, that was not what I wanted to say. Stop crying. Please smile for me. Do I have it's another okay. mother? No! No! No, no, no. Smile for me. You're fine, girls. You are my friend. Not lie to me. You do. She was the queen's sister. Firstly, married to the king before he got married to the queen, before you were born. She died while giving birth to you. She's such a kind, beautiful woman. Unlike her sister, the queen. So after her death, the whole royal household, the guards and the maidens. We are warned never to mention her to your hearing, thereby making you believe that the queen is your biological mother. Promise me, she said, that you will not let anyone know about this thing, please. Because what I just did now is capable of costing me my life. If anyone gets to know about it, please. I promise no one will hear about it because I don't want you dead. You have been kind to me. Thank you for telling me the truth. At least now I know I'm not being tortured by my own mother. It's okay, my dear. The girls are kind, okay? And they will see you through. Come here. Beautiful girl, <laughs> let me sing that to your favorite song for you. She sing the Marama. She sing the Asama. Smile for me now. <laughs> I want to show you something that can interest you. Would you? Hmm? What is it that you want to show me? Okay. Come, let me show you. Okay. okay. Here, she's in the this is where your mother was married.
sorrows on sorrows Is it her destiny? Is it her destiny? I will get it covered Get it covered Get it covered She's got a heart filled with love So much to give Why make her proud? Why don't you ponder? What do you think you're doing? Do you know the implication if anyone sees you here or knows that you have an idea about this? It could cost my life. I'm sorry, I can't do it. I can't help it. It's okay. I can't help it. Okay. okay. Promise you won't do it again. I promise. With all due respect to your majesty, it seems that your warnings and my advice to my daughter here has become fruitless. That she keep on torturing my granddaughter, her niece. Please, your majesty, permit me to take my granddaughter with me. Let me at least take care of her. Biko. I do not understand what you mean, mother-in-law. We have no problems. No one tortures my daughter, the princess. We live in peace. We have been living in peace. My princess, is that not true? Mother-in-law, you can see, she confirmed it herself. So, you have nothing to worry about. My princess, my princess, come. Mother, you heard my husband, the king. We are living in peace. So don't bother yourself or my family again. Um, please, can I spend the night here with my granddaughter? Mother-in-law. You don't have to ask. It's your home. Feel free. Grandma, I think it's raining tonight. <laughs> Same day. It's raining already. It's going to be a very cool weather tonight. So, I have to sing for you before you sing. Hey, Grandma, sing for me. If I am singing, you will be answering me. Say it. Good. Oh, one more chicken kaloge. Oh, one more chicken kaloge. Emana wunye de mo de inja. How are you doing today, Mother? I'm fine. 
She's in the here and needs to sleep, so I suggest you go to your guest house. Don't worry. I will sleep with her here. And I insist you go to your guest room. We are happy. She is my granddaughter. Can't you see that we are here playing? Now are we not happy? Yes, we are happy. Mother, I insist you go to the guest room. She simply here needs to sleep. <coughs> Come get me a cup of water. Please, please. Okay. <coughs> Why do you hate to see smile and laughter in her innocent face? I don't understand what you're saying. Oh yes, I am your mother. You have equally deceived the king to turn his face away from her. But I must warn you, desist from this evil or I will expose you and say the truth. Is that a threat? To make you change from your evil ways. Neck big, the red one. No, no, my queen, I didn't. But I've searched for it everywhere and I, I can't find it. Send me the guards and maidens at once. I'm not yes, enough, yeah. Yeah, they go on us I'm a I can't believe my precious beard grew wings and flew away. Maddened. Yes, Your Majesty. Are you sure you knew nothing about these beads? Yes, Your Majesty. Yes, Your Majesty. Guards. Your Majesty. Yes, Your Majesty. Has anyone been here? None, my queen, except your mother who just left. My mother. Hurry! Hurry now and go search her! If you find the breed with her, bring her here at once. Do you mean your own mother, my queen? Yes, I mean my mother. Hurry now! Uh -huh. United we stand, divided we fall Someone please help me tell them And nobody an island mm. I was again in a We do respect in the by the order of His Majesty, the King, we are to search your basket for a missing bead in the palace. A missing bead? Yes. Yeah. 
How did he get in here? Excuse me, all explanation should be in the palace. Let's go. Let's go. I didn't do this, so. Gabana, Gabana. I didn't do it, so. Move. I'm I'm innocent, I'm innocent. Hey, I'm not going to be put on my queen, please calm down. Until the guards return. I know, but it must be found. Move. We found this missing bird in her basket, wrapped with Princess Chisimdi's robe. Ah! Igwe, I don't know anything about this, so I didn't know how it got into this basket. I don't know. This is a setup. Come the water, oh. come the water. Mother, how can you embarrass and disappoint me this way? Woman, this is a shameful act. How could you steal from your own daughter? You must be punished for this despicable act. Eh? Do you know stealing from the royal household? Could a man to death penalty? Please, my husband. I don't want her dead. She's my mother. Permit me to pronounce the judgment. As you wish, my queen. Guards, lock her up with Princess Chisimdi. Till I decide on what to do. As it pleases you, Your eh, Majesty. Bia, bia, nketi, nketi, give one me me far. Move. Nketi, I do this to me. Abu Kano Mike. I'm so sorry. 
I honestly feel so bad that you lost the prince's proposal to me. But you know it wasn't intended. You know that from my heart, I do wish you well. I wish I could make him change his mind. But you know, no one can question the prince's decision. Biko, Biko, my sister. I'm very sorry. Take her, Biko. Your sister is right. This is a situation none of us can do anything about. Maybe that was the design of the gods. You have to move on. Please. Thank the gods we did not lose him entirely. Not when you will still marry your blood sister. Please. It's okay, I understand. Thank you very much for your understanding, Kitchen. The gods have their reason. Nkechi. Mm -hmm. My sister. Mm -hmm. I need to ask a favor from you. I'm scared. I'm worried. But I honestly hope that you do not disappoint me. I am all ears. Ask whatever. You're my blood sister, aren't you? The least I could do is disappoint you. Very well then. Hey. Gechi. Mm hmm Can you... I mean, will you... Would you speak? Ask me. Can you marry my husband? What? Do you realize what you're asking of me? To marry your husband? Adobe? Yes. We're sisters. One blood. We ought to share when the need arises. What does it matter? You have what I do not have. What I may or may never have as a woman. A life in your womb. Something my husband and I crave for. If you do not marry him, Kichi, he'll certainly marry. To try for a seat, an heir to his throne. Think of the consequences, my sister, of bringing the total stranger to my house of sharing my matrimonial bed with a stranger. Save me from this shame, pain and disgrace. Bear this child for my husband. A child from my own blood. Marry him and sleep with him and pretend this child is his. It'll be a secret between us. Sisters, one blood. I will not tell him you're pregnant. Save me from this pain, Kichi. And save my husband from this emotional torture that has threatened to rip him apart. Help me, my sister. If you do this for me, Kechi, I will forever be indebted to you. Please. What say you, sister? Are you 
people sure of the decision you, you have taken? I know why I am asking. I am an elder. I see beyond your understanding. Are you sure? Mother, we are sure and we have made up our minds. Yes, Mother. This is the least I can do to save my sister from this pain and humiliation. Don't worry. Everything will be alright. If you say so. Before your tummy becomes pronounced, to avoid suspicion, Okay, as you wish. Very well then. I have good news. What good news? I'm pregnant for you. Don't tell me it's a joke. No, it's not a joke, my king. I can't joke with such. Oh. <laughs> May the gods be praised. May the gods be praised. Your sister was right. Oh, you have indeed made me more happier than I am. Thank you. Thank you for bringing blessing to this home and my kingdom. Oh. <laughs> I promise you. I will cherish you more than I have ever done. Thank you. Tell me, what was his reaction? I have never seen him that excited before. Oh. I knew it. I knew he'd be so happy. Finally, he's going to become the happy man he has always been. And all his sorrows will be over. Oh, Nkichi. <laughs> Thank you so much. Come on. Thank you for saving us. <laughs> Thank you. My sister. Please tell me. He smiled? He smiled. He even <laughs> touched my tongue. <gasps> he did.
pregnancy is the reason it goes up. My baby. The garment. My baby. <laughs> My baby. How long is it going to take? You want to break down the skirt? Go and tell the king that I need to see him in my chambers now. Go! <laughs> oh! Underneath. Long live my king. The queen, her majesty, requests your presence in her chambers. She said it is urgent. Um. <laughs> tell her I will be with her when I come back. Yes, your majesty. I am sorry, mother, but you asked for me. Nothing, I mean nothing, in this world can ever come between I and my son in this palace. But grandma, did you do it? No, I didn't. I didn't. Someone framed us up. Then who? <laughs> I can't really tell. But someone did that. Hmm. Mm. But don't worry yourself, eh? Let me tell you that story again. Come on, tell me. You will answer in in now. Oh, one more can call again. Oh, one more can call again. Oh, one more can call again. I never believed they could have such an evil theft plan against the old woman. I really feel for her. See, I'm so surprised. Who knows? Nobody can be trusted. Just as the Queen said. If they are not guilty, then who? Ah. You and I should be thanking the girls for exposing them. If not, I wonder what the King would have done towards the palace in. Uh -uh. Especially we that are in charge of the Queen's chambers. Ah uh ah, -uh, Ngozi. Why talk like this? Eh? Whatever that happens, I know that they are innocent. Yes, they are. So who did it? You or me? Ah uh ah. -uh. Ngozi, I may not know what happened, but one thing I know is that the gods will fight for them. I wonder why you worry about their plight. Are you somehow related to them? Tell me. Ngozi, why are you talking like this? You and I know that the late queen, Queen Adobe, is a very kind and humble woman. So I, I, I think that her daughter deserves some kind of sympathy from us. Don't you have feelings for human beings? I really feel for her. Look at the poor girl. The queen, the queen. The queen is coming. Would you say that she bring this way? Sorry. Sorry. Thank you. No! But you said you should bring it. Yes, ma'am. Oh, may the gods reward her. Eh? Please See? tell her that I am so grateful. Oh? Madam, my daughter, do not believe that I did it. I didn't do it. I know you didn't do it. But the gods will see you true. I have to take my leaves now. Before the guards will come and see me here. Okay, okay. I miss her. I miss you too. Now we are Chicodia, now we are. I do make it. I do for me wonder. I do tell you now why I'm not bad yet. Oh, 
Adi mebu, adi kwa muwanda. Nke da chikali, sabulu chikali. Spirits of the dead, why is your soul restless? Njinji. Eyes and mouthpiece of the gods. Why have the gods shut their hearts to the affliction of the innocent and their ears to their cries? Why must my mother and daughter suffer injustice? And yet, the gods remain silent. Beg the gods. Ask them to hear the cry of the innocent so that I can rest. The gods have not lost their sight. Neither have they gone deaf. They have heard the cries of your gentle soul. The sound of your broken heart. Do not worry. In the station, that in no time they will speak. Hey! Ibada wute tibo dejo Eje lo kuru piri te dewa Ase mo kuwa yo kwa mpili mpili wa Si e chuo babo si me chuno ba Miri sere wa mwa mruo de digwe <laughs> My great angel, you're welcome. I... <laughs> Njiji the Great One, the eyes and the mouth piece of the gods. I wasn't expecting you. To what do I owe your visit? Your Majesty, a great stench hovers around this palace. Abomination has been committed. A taboo has been committed. And the gods born in rot. I do not understand you. You speak in the way too complex for my mortal comprehension. The Queen. The Queen, Your Majesty, she is guilty of terrible sins she committed. And it's time for her to pay for her sins. How dare you walk into the palace? Today is a day of retribution. The hour of justice. You evil woman. My king, would you sit there and watch this wizard accuse me wrongly? He must be punished for his insubordination to the queen. Yes, you must be punished. You are stripped of your title as the chief priest of Ungoku. You are hereby punished to the evil forest. <laughs> 
And who is evil here now? God! I know that the spell you use on him is a strong one. The wise one, you are here. What's wrong with the queen? She is reaping the evil seed she sowed. Here, you have been tied to her spell as her puppet. But the gods have set you free from her bondage, and the gods have heard the cries of your late wife, who sowed is restless and set you free from her bondage she have a confession to make confess else the gods will descend on you like a fierce furnace please i will confess i killed that dog with my sister i killed that dog with my sister because i was jealous of the king's love towards her please i framed my mother off i framed my mother and my niece off I planted my, I planted my bead inside that cloth where it was found. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, please. And my son. My son, yes, my son. Ah! My son is not the king's biological son. What? Yes, yes. He's not my blood? Yes, yes. I was pregnant for Gamma before you married me, please. I'm sorry. I told you, Your Majesty, that she is evil. All thanks to the gods for their intervention. Where is my princess? Where is my daughter? Your Majesty, the Queen ordered us to lock her and her grandmother in the cell. Go get my princess. Bring my daughter. Bring, bring my daughter now. Bring her! Oh, please, I'm sorry. I'm sorry! I'm sorry! Oh, mama, you're going to love me. Oh, I didn't love you, you're going to love me. Even in the world, I'm going to love you. Oh, give me a point, also. What again? Oh, mama, you're going to love me. The king demands your presence immediately. Hey, take it easy on her. Get up. Take it easy on her. Leave me! Get up. This way. Hey, oh! Mm. What happens to my daughter? Mama! 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 Hey, hey! Mama. <laughs> To be called your daughter. She's evil. She mothered her own sister out of envy. She imprisoned you and my daughter, the princess, because you threatened to expose the paternity of her son. She's cursed and banished from this kingdom. She will be thrown into the evil forest. Where things like her belong. Let her go there and suffer her pains. The wise one. Thank you. Thank you for this liberation. When the wind blew, the anus of a chicken get exposed. I am only a messenger of the gods. And that which they sent me here has been fulfilled. All thanks belongs to our chi. Mama, Mama, please. Mama. Ah. Hey. Guts. Ah. Her Majesty, take her to the No, no, no. Mama, Mama, please. Mama. <laughs> My king, please. Mama, please. Mama, please. Mama, please. Mama, get up, get up. Mama, Mama. Oh, poor Mama, get up. 
My two children are gone. Please, 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 please. <laughs> Now that it is over, I shall take my leave. Your Highness, she pulled my sword by herself and took her life. Hey! Please don't do that. Hey! Fair enough. She has taken her own fate by her own hand. Go and get me Agama the drunk. And take her to the evil forest because she deserves no burial. It is unfortunate how it all happened. I wish that you take care of your son. Yes, Your Majesty. He's your blood. I cannot father another man's child. Take care of your son. Take care of him. He's not my father. Go, Your Highness. Your kindness can never be overestimated. Today, you make me a happy man. Knowing that after all my responsibilities, I'm a father to a child. May our God, Ngoku, bless you for your kindness, your majesty. Come to me. She's not my father. Please. Go. I'm sorry, I'm very sorry for all that has happened. But I promise you, I will get you a woman who will take good care of you. A woman that will love you like her own child and give you another brother. Father. Yes, dear. I have a request. Oh, my princess, say it. Anything for you, I will do it. I already have someone whom I want you to marry. Someone who is kind to me. Someone who will make us happy. And who could that be, my princess? Mm. Would you want the palace wedding?
With that heavy port, do you want to kill yourself? It was mother that sent me. Get you again? Are you okay? No, I'm feeling sick. Oh, so sorry. Ah, so sorry, your body is hot. Ah, see, she seemed mm -hmm. I would have helped you. But you know that the queen wants us that whenever she sends you an errand, we shouldn't assist you. Mm -hmm. But... No, 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 I don't want to go to you. No, she said we don't want to go No, 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 I don't want to go to you. Don't worry, I can handle it. Look at your body, you're sick. Just get a rest, okay? Thank you. You have always been kind to me. Oh, don't worry. It's nothing. <laughs> Your Majesty. Good morning. Your Majesty, you sent for me. You're welcome. Let's sit down. Thank you, Your Majesty. You're welcome. Good morning. Good morning. The humble wish of my daughter has brought favor to you. She has told me how nice and kind you've been to her. And every good deed deserves a good reward. My princess has requested that I should marry you. And now I ask, Ujunga, would you like to be the queen of Ungalama? And the wonderful mother to my daughter, the princess. Yes. Oh, oh! I'm, I'm so sorry, with you. So, I mean, I. Your Majesty, please, are you okay? I'm, I'm perfectly fine, with you. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm very okay. With all due respect, Your Majesty, I don't think you look happy. Please permit me to say that I know the reason for your sadness, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, please, don't let it bother you so much. I may not know the reason why she, she hates you so much. But one thing I know is that you are a good woman, Your Majesty. And you deserve to be happy. Please, Your Majesty, just leave everything for the gods to judge. I believe one day 
she will come back to her senses. Please, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, it's of great honor to serve you, Your Majesty. Ujuma, thank you. And may the gods also bless you with a good man to call husband. Thank you, Your Majesty. She's got a heart filled with love, so much to give. Why make her cry? Maybe. Prayers have brought me favors from the gods. Your Majesty, I, Ujumwa, promise to be all that to you and even more. <laughs> Chalanya, on your channel, can I have a good night? 